Shalom and welcome. This is Minister and Prophet Robert Lee Williams from Prophetic Information Ministries and God's Miracle Ministry, where we blow the trumpet, the shofar, around the world, informing you with prophetic news and bringing God's Miracle Ministry to the world. Well, today is Sunday, March 16th, 2014. And uh, it is 8.36 p.m. And I, I want to let you guys know, as I said in my previous video, that uh, my internet and my cable is going off in the morning. And I owe like oh, $280, I think it is, or 286 something like that. I don't have the money to pay for it. So this is going to be my last video for at least a week or two. But uh, that's a good thing right now. You know, until more donations come into this ministry to help me pay the bills because I'm living by myself now. And uh, that's a good thing. And I'm going to tell you why. Because God has got me here to put me on a journey with Him. He's going to be teaching me many things. And I knew this was going to happen one day. And I praise God that it did. That it's going to happen. Here within the next two weeks, when I come back up on YouTube, you're going to see a change in me. A change. What I said in that previous video, that I was able to walk freely in the gifts of God. And the gifts of faith in God. To show signs and wonders and miracles. This is something God has planted in my heart all my life. All my life. If you listen to any of my videos in the archives, you'll notice that God's given me the gift of healing. It's the working of miracles. These things are going to take place. But within the next two weeks, after I'm done here, I'm going to start walking in that. Because God's got me on a training course now. I'm going, today I went to a church service over at Thurman Scribner's Church up in, I think, Wiley, Texas. And uh, I hear him quite frequently on the radio. And uh, I checked out his website. And uh, this man is a man of faith. He's 75 years old now. He gets around very well. He knows the word. But oh my God, does this, this is a man of faith. God's got him in teaching faith. He, he awesome testimonies. He works in the gifts of healing and in miracles. And I knew in my heart that I had to go there today to his church service. And I did. I'm glad I did. Before the service came started, he uh, came around to two or three people and shook their hands. And he came over to me. I was sitting down. I stood up, shook his hand, and he held on to my hand for just a little bit. And my... God, did I feel the anointing off this man. He is an anointed man of God. A true man of God. He started talking to me. And I, I, I said something to him too. That, And he said, come with me. I want to show you something, Robert. So I went over and into the hallway. And he showed me a picture of this girl that had eczema most of her life, and she was all scarred up, and, and she was probably, I don't know, 10, 11 years old in this picture, and, and she looked like she got beat up real bad, but
But these were scars from this eczema on her arms and on her face, just all over. And you know, she was bound to be hurting. And uh, he taught about that today in, in, in church and how sin entered into the parents, especially in the mom. And uh, when the mom finally repented of the sins and he prayed over this girl again, within a short time she was completely healed with no scars. And uh, that really touched me. He, he also talked about his granddaughter, how her mother and his wife got killed in a uh, car accident years ago. And uh, the little granddaughter was three. And she got hurt severely in this car wreck. But I'm not going to go into the testimony, but I saw this girl that was severely injured. And, and you know, I was just kind of glued on her at the beginning of the service. And then he talked about her. And after he got talking about her and what, how God healed this girl, you know, it, it's hard to keep your eyes off of her because to see a beautiful girl, which is like 13, something like that, of a miracle that God did. He restored her health. Got rid of all the scars off her face. Gave her her eyes back. She's able to walk and talk like anybody else and play like any child would. A miracle child. And that's his granddaughter. And that was so awesome just to see her and to see how much faith he has in the Word of God. I want this faith. I want to walk into my destiny. But now God is going to put me on a training course this next two weeks. Why? Because Thurman has got hundreds of CDs and DVDs around that place that he's given over the years. And all these things are free. I walked into sanctuary. I said, oh my God. I've never seen so many DVDs and CDs in my life in one place. And they're all free. You can take as many as you want. Wow. So I'm watching one right now. It, it's on the gifts of the Spirit. You know, I, I knew I had to stop and, and give you a testimony. And I'm going to give you some of the titles that I'm going to be watching over the next two weeks. You know, you know the gifts of the Spirit. This one here is called uh, Holiness Pleases God. Have the God kind of faith. Holy Spirit, Holy Spirit empowerment. God is in the healing business. God warns us in dreams and visions. Testimonies. Of miraculous healings God's power I was listening to this on the way home on a CD and I cried on the way home I would encourage you to go to Thurman Scribner's website and request this it's called God's power get that it won't cost you anything a great earthquake is coming faith Worship and praise. The healer is in you. Use the keys of the kingdom. Your miracle is in your mouth. You don't have to be sick. You are children of the Most High God. Who are you trusting in? Praise Him for trials and tests. Promises of faith. Ready your spiritual weapons. Receive God's promises by faith. The secret wisdom of God. Sins of unbelief. 
something we all kind of suffer on. Divine Healing. In the 2009 Burnham, Texas Healing School, which he does do a healing school at his church the second uh, Saturday of the month. I'm going to start attending that. But I want to let you know within the next two weeks, because I can't watch TV anymore starting tomorrow. I need to get rid of that TV anyway. And I'm going to be here on this brand new computer watching my DVDs and listening to the CDs. And you're going to see a changed Robert. You're going to see a man of God that's going to start walking in these miracles. Things that God has been putting in my life all my life. Something I've been praying for and longing for. And I'm going to start walking in this. Because this is the time for me to do this. I know it. I feel it in my heart. I feel it. The time is right. And I'm going to continue to go to his church until God tells me to leave. Because I have to learn something and I have to get this anointing now. Because this is the time. Oh, praise God. I thank Him for what He's done in my life and what He's going to do in my life. Because I want to walk in great faith, great miracles, signs and wonders to glorify the Lord Jesus Christ. To glorify Him. To glorify our Father in Heaven. I'm going to prove to you, especially to the non-believers, that the God is alive. Jesus is alive and still sitting on the throne. That He is the Son of the Most High God. I'm going to prove to you. Now, He's going to prove to you. I'm just going to access His power. Access Him. And He's going to demonstrate His power for the world to see. Thank you, Jesus. And I want to thank each and every one of you for tuning in to watching this video today. And you're going to see a new Robert. You're going to see a new man of God here walking in these great miracles here within two weeks. I'm going to be opening up this Bible more. I'm going to be studying more. And I'm going to be doing this. I have nothing else to do except serve God, be obedient, walk holy before Him, and get over here on my knees and on my face every day. And then I'm going to listen to these teachings, and I'm going to learn from God on what He's got to tell me. And I suggest that you do the same. Get in your prayer closet. And you start learning things that he has you to learn. He's opened up a door for me today, and I'm going to walk in it, and I'm going to get this. Two weeks. In two weeks, my electric bill will be paid. My cable and internet will be restored. It will be paid in full in the name of Jesus. And I'm going to get caught up on my truck payment, which I'm like $400 behind in. And there's three tires that I need desperately on there. I'm going to start praying in faith that all three tires come in. That's $300 a piece. That's $300. I'm going to have faith that I'm going not only work for this money, but there's going to be people donate to my ministry. And we're going to get these things paid for. And I want a new webcam. This is kind of fuzzy. Even though it's on a brand new computer. I'm going to get me another webcam to put on top here. And I'm going to get me a new web creator. So I can redo my websites. Because they haven't been updated in a long, long time. 
And if you want to help me out, just send in your donation today. Just go to propheticinformationministries.com or godsmiracleministry.com and, and make a donation there. Or you can mail it in, however you want to do it. PayPal be preferably. But, you know, I just wanted to give you guys an update. And I thank you for listening. And I'll see you, hopefully, here in about two weeks. In Jesus' name. Take care. God bless each and every one of you. And you're going to see a man who's going to walk. In God's healing power, His miracles, and the Spirit of God. You're going to see me walk in the gifts of the Spirit like you've never seen before. Because I give up today, my life today, to serve God and to bring God to you. Take care. God bless you. I love you, and I'll see you in about two weeks.